What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. For those of you who are new to this channel, welcome. My name is Bondi Johnson. I am the founder and part owner of Roasted Coffee Company. My channel is a mixture of coffee and business. I like to help people who are looking to start their own coffee roasting companies kind of navigate the field. I go into topics as little as some tips and tricks you need to know along the way to help save you money to topics as big as when should I buy a roaster? When should I buy a grinder? Where do I get bags? And everything else of that nature. For those of you who are coming back, what's up? Today's video is gonna be a readdressing of the cost of starting your own coffee roasting company. I previously made a video and I kind of ran through how much it cost me to start the coffee roasting company I currently own with my three business partners. But I wanted to go back through and address different tiers of pricing and some of them are cheaper than others. I have laid out three plans by which you could start your own coffee roasting company. It's inclusive of everything that you would need to do so. Last one was just an example of mine. This is gonna be what you could do. And I have laid them out. They're all in my ebook, but I'm giving you guys a little sneak peek. Give me a little sneak peek. And here we're gonna just go through each one of these three and I'm gonna give you exactly what equipment I'm talking about and how much it costs you, as well as the grand total. I think you guys are gonna be kind of surprised by the prices that I'm giving here, and that's exactly why I'm making this video. So pay close attention. We're starting with baby steps. Also, I'm all out of coffee, which is extremely disappointing, but I'll make it through this. So baby steps with intent to sell. What we have here are the following items. Roaster, coffee, a scale, a grinder, bags, labels, a heat sealer, and a brewing set. So stuff to just brew your coffee, mostly so that you can try your own coffee as you roast it. But let's start at the top. A roaster, which one do we have? The Fresh Roast SR540. That is right now $189 on Amazon. I'll put links to these things below in the description. Okay, $189. Next, we have coffee. Now I'm sourcing from sweetmarias.com. It's a great place for beginners to start. At 25 pounds, that's four different coffees, all at $6 a pound for a grand total of $150, okay? Don't worry about keeping tabs of the prices, I'll give you the total at the end. A scale, I use a cozy blue digital coffee scale. It's $15, $15.99 on Amazon. I love this scale, I use it every day. The grinder, we're looking at Millstone Grindmaster 810. That is a $300 purchase, but that grinder will last you pretty much the lifetime of your business. So bags, right now we're just starting with bags on Amazon. We're gonna purchase in a quantity of 50 and that's gonna be a grand total of 36.99. Again, right on Amazon. Labels, we're gonna get some labels on Uprinting, which is a super cheap source of labels. Not my favorite, but super affordable. So we're gonna buy a quantity of 50 labels for 39.59 and I believe I priced these at a six by four label, okay? So you could cover the whole bag. The heat sealer that we're gonna to wanna to get that's also on Amazon. It is a crimp heat sealer, okay? Not an impulse heat sealer. It's $96.99. And our last item is the brewing set, which you may already have, so you might be able to take this cost off. But here, this is gonna include uh, the kettle. This is gonna include a grinder. This is gonna include that same scale that we're talking about and a pour over set. That's $112.57. So this is a grand total, okay? Of the everything, grand total, to start your own coffee roasting company baby steps with intent to sell, $953.63. That's not too shabby. Everything that I just laid out there, $953.63. Now I go into a profit breakdown after. I go into, this is how many bags you need to sell to actually start seeing profit or return on your investment. I include the repurchases. I include what quantities you have to sell in, what quantities you have to purchase in, all of that stuff. But I'm not gonna get into that. The price per bag following this plan is $7.53. That's your cost for one bag of coffee, labeled, heat sealed, good to go out the door, okay? Or in the mail, whatever. Your profit selling this coffee at $10.50 is $2.97 a bag. That's 28% profit a bag. Not too shabby. So let's skip to our middle ground. I like to call this one hit the ground running, okay? This is with a greater intention to sell. You're, you know you wanna get into the coffee roasting industry, so you wanna skip that baby step. You wanna just get right into what is a little bit more of a business, a little bit more of an upfront cost, but you're gonna be able to produce more and lower that cost per bag. So we have a roaster, it is the Bemmer, which is $450, it's a one pound roaster, okay? Our coffee purchase now is still from Sweet Maria's, is gonna be 50 pounds of coffee, four different coffees, okay, at $5.50 a pound. And that's $275 in total for that coffee purchase. 
Same cozy blue digital scale, $15.99. We're doing the same grinder, $300. We're now buying 100 bags, still on Amazon, which is gonna be $64.99. We're doing our U printing for labels, okay? We're just now buying at 100 labels instead of 50 for a total of $60.18. $60 and then we're getting the same heat sealer, same brewing set. The grand total of this one is going to be $1,375.72, okay? So maybe about $400 more, but our cost per bag is now a dollar less at $6.74 per bag. And we're still gonna sell at that same price of 1050, making a profit of $3.76 a bag, which is a 36% profit a bag. So that's an increase of 8% profit per bag. That's a good jump. Now, the last one that we're gonna talk about is what I call, I got time and money, all right? This is zero to 100. You are full faith you wanna get in the coffee roasting industry, so you're just gonna dive right in and skip all the BS, okay? No baby steps for you. The roaster we're gonna start with is the one that I'm currently using right now. Well, this is the one model up. So this is the Artisan 3E, okay? It is a three pound coffee roaster, which exponentially increases your output. And that is $3,950, okay? We're going to buy 100 pounds of coffee, four different coffees, at $4 a pound each, and we're gonna buy that from ccmcoffee.com. Fantastic importer of Tampa, Florida that I love. Their coffee is phenomenal. They've been doing this since the 1920s. They know what they're doing. So that total cost is going to be $400. We're gonna still use that same cozy blue digital coffee skill, okay? $15.99. Same millstone grinder, $300. We're going to buy our bags from PDFY this time in a quantity of 500, okay? That's a big jump but our cost there is gonna be $212. It's really not that big of a difference. You're getting a lot more bags. Now our labels are still gonna be coming from U-Printing at a quantity of 500 this time, and that's gonna be a total of $129.60, okay? We're using U-Printing right now strictly for the sole purpose that the cost is affordable. You can, you can adjust who you're using uh, along the, the, the time period of growth, uh, depending on what you wanna see and the changes that you wanna make, but for right now, we're using U-Printing, super cheap, Quality is decent. The heat sealer, same one on Amazon.com, $96.99. And that same brewing set that we've talked about in every one, $112.57. Okay, that's just so you can taste your coffee. The total cost for this, the hit the ground running, which is basically how our business operates right now, is $5,217.15. That's to the cent, okay? I have priced all of these out to the cent. Now, your cost per bag is $4.68. That is really good. That's a really good cost per bag, okay? Now this is per pound of coffee. So a one pound bag of coffee is $4.68. All right, we're gonna still sell it at the same price of 1050, which is pretty cheap in my opinion. You could sell it for more. Our profit then is $5.82, okay? That's 55% profit a bag. Those are phenomenal margins. So with all that being said, those are the different levels of starting your own coffee roasting company. 956 or $3, double check, $953.63 $63 to start a coffee roasting company. Okay, that's baby steps. But our next one up is only $400 more at $1,375.72. And then our last one, obviously, is the most expensive, but your output and your, your profit per bag increases exponentially, okay? And that's $5,217.15. So I know I ran through that. This is all available and laid out in my ebook with links to everything. I'll put links down in the description below. But for those of you looking to get serious about starting your own coffee roasting company, you don't need to, to give an arm and a leg, okay, to start. You can start small and just grow as you want, or you can say, you know what? I have the time and I have the money. I'm gonna go all in. And now you know exactly what you should buy and where to buy it. All right, that's it. So hopefully that was insightful. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. You learned something from it. I look forward to seeing you in the next video.